it. I can't decide if things are about to get worse or better. We'd better try this way. Together down here. a bear just ahead. See her? I'd rather not tangle with her right now. You might be able to sneak by. Just take it nice and slow and watch where you step. Or if you're feeling lucky, you can take this boat. Might take it by surprise. Go ahead. I'll follow your lead and watch your back. This looks like the way out. I was starting to wonder if we'd ever make it. Life is good. I think we're almost out. Come on!
Looks like he's gone for good this time. But I don't think we should stick around to see if he comes back. Closest town from here is Riverwood. My uncle's the blacksmith there. I'm sure he'd help you out. It's probably best if we split. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. Listen, you should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. You could really use someone like you. And if the rebels have themselves a dragon, General... Listen, you should go to Solitude. But you didn't know? That was Ulfric Stormcloak and his top lieutenants. Right, the leader of the Stormcloaks. They claim to be fighting for Skyrim's freedom. But the war is really all about Ulfric wanting to be High King of Skyrim. You haven't heard of the civil war in Skyrim? I guess down in Cyrodiil, people have other things to worry about. It's pretty simple. Ulfric founded the Stormcloaks years ago, as a sort of private army to advance his ambitions. He's always used the ban on the warship of Talos to stir people up against the Empire. He never succeeded in getting much support, so a few months ago he murdered the High King. That got the Empire's attention. A masterstroke by General Tullius. He's only been in charge here for a few months, but he's turned things around for the Empire. We've been trying to catch Ulfric since the war started, but he always seemed to slip through our fingers, like he knew we were coming. This time, the General turned the tables on him. Ulfric rode right into our ambush with only a few bodyguards. He surrendered pretty meekly too. So much for his death or glory reputation. I thought we were taking Ulfric back to Cyrodiil, but I guess the General changed his mind. You know the rest. So did I. If the damn Stormcloak somehow found one, or woke it up, the war might be about to take an ugly turn. Hard to believe it was just a coincidence that the first dragon anyone's seen for centuries attacks just as Ulfric was about to be executed. Of course. I know, today wasn't the best introduction to the Legion, but I hope you'll give us another chance. The Legion could really use someone like you, especially now. And if the Rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. No, not yet. After all, a dragon, something out of old tales and legends, no one could have expected that. But you can bet he'll be trying to figure it out. This could shift the whole balance of the war. If you want to help stop that dragon, your best bet is to go to Solitude and join up with the Legion. I hope so. The Legion is Skyrim's only hope right now. Come on, we better get moving. See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. When I was a boy, that place always used to give me nightmares. Draugr creeping down the mountain to climb through my window at night. That kind of thing. I admit, I still don't much like the look of it. Come on. I feel better once we're under cover in Riverwood. We'd better keep moving. I feel like that drag- friend. Hey! 
computer skin. I'm glad you decided to come with me. We're almost to River. I hope that dragon isn't still flying around here somewhere. We'd better keep moving. I feel like that dragon might be up there watching us right now. my own. Nobody believes me, but I tell you. Did you hear? Hello. Hello. Feindall thinks he can woo. Truly? So maybe my mother isn't crazy after all. You had best tell the Jarl in Whiterun. He needs to know about this. Shh, uncle, please. Keep your voice down. I'm fine. Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood trader to speak with him when I'm not around. He's wasting his time. Okay, okay, come inside. I'd better get going. You look like a traveler. Lucan's got a little bit of everything at the Riverwood trader. If you need weapons or armor, see Alvor, the blacksmith. Ain't every day we get visitors in Riverwood. Of course, take what you need. But what's all this about? What are you two doing here? Dragon? In Helgen? That explains what I saw earlier. Flying down the valley from the south. I was hoping I was wrong about what I thought it was. A dragon. Here in Skyrim. What's this world coming to? First the war, now dragons. Trouble loves company, they say. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. But if you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt.
do not like the load screens in this game, but I guess that's a crafting. Thing.